Mom says she didn't know who he was. She checked with neighbors. They didn't know who he was. I left interviewing Mom today, scratching my head, but I wasn't the only one. This apparently had police scratching their heads, the, the neighbors scratching their head, and Mom and this entire family scratching their heads, trying to figure out what this man was doing in their home for so long. So all the adults were out here putting together the swing set. My daughter came outside and said, there was just a man standing outside of Max's bedroom. Let's call that man Mr. Cool, Calm, and Collected. Without a car, he walks up to this presidential farm's home like he belonged there, walking right past this ring camera while looking at his phone. Doesn't ring the doorbell, but just walked right into the unlocked door where the only people inside were children, including a very observant seven-year-old. She just kept her head down and noticed the shoes twice when she walked past. Then she did it again and just kind of looked at That was it. She didn't make eye contact with him, but she noticed that he was wearing black and green camo Crocs with little charms in it, like pizza and hot sauce. Mom says he never said a word to any of the children he saw inside, but for 16 minutes, he was inside their home, upstairs, downstairs. Eventually, he walked out the same way he came in. Cool, calm, but he collected not one thing. Okay. Nothing was disturbed. And I asked my daughter, did he go into bedrooms? Did he, was he doing anything? Did he ever open my bedroom door? No. When the adults finally realized what happened, they called police and checked with neighbors. I really am trying to see the good here and that it really was an honest mistake because I, it doesn't make sense to me in any other way. Um, I don't think somebody would case somebody's house in the middle of broad daylight on a Sunday with people home. There was two motorcycles and a car in the driveway. Mom says she is hoping he turns himself in so that she can get a clue into what he was trying to do and so she can ask him to finish what he interrupted. Then he has to come finish putting the swing set together. And that'll be the follow-up story when that happens. Listen, Mom ch says she's using this as an opportunity to speak with her kids about stranger danger, Mark, and she encourages other parents to do the same thing. I can understand why, Wale. This is a bizarre story. I know video shows the man walk up to the home. We saw that. People at home saw that. Did police know if he went to any other homes yesterday? Yes, yeah, so I asked police that question. They said they had no other complaints yesterday afternoon of any kind. Mom did share this on social media. It's been shared hundreds and hundreds of times. Apparently, there were some people who gave tips to police. One person has been checked out that they had an alibi. The other person, at least for now, police are still investigating. For now, that's the very latest here in Northbridge. Wale, LAU, Boston, 25 tonight. Well, at least they have the video, and they can keep pouring over that. Wale, thanks.